This is a video on how to use WeVideo in the app if you're using your phone or on an iPad. There's another video, how to use WeVideo, which I recommend that you watch first. It's a little bit more thorough, showing it on a computer. So I'm just going to show the differences here between the app and the computer. Um, uh, the first thing you'll need to do is go to the App Store, which is why I'm here, and you will um, get the video. My uh, option is open. You can see next to WeVideo because I've already downloaded it. Once you've done that, you're going to um, log in using th Microsoft 360 uh, and your username and password uh, that you use for everything in the district, like your email, Schoology, etc. So I'm going to open WeVideo, and here is the home place with the videos I've made so far. Um, the three lines on the top left-hand corner, that's going to open up my menu. So over here, I can get to the, the, the different menu items. Um, I am going to press Create in the top right-hand corner so I can make a video, and I will name it, and we'll, tr we'll call this uh, app, app Test. And I'll press Done, and this is now my home screen where uh, I will be making the video. You can see in the top left hand corner if I press Wii Video Essentials, for example, the third one down there, it opens up all those different videos that, that you saw before, but I'm going to go straight to camera and it's going to open up my camera. Now, by default here, it is facing outwards and you can see here on my kitchen table that I have a dinosaur. Um, I, in the, if you're looking on the screen there, under the white button is the word video or photo. You want to make sure if you're trying to make a, a video that you press video, and, and then if you're trying to video yourself, you turn it around. With the button above the, uh, with the, above the record button. So I'm going to press that, turn it around, here I am. You can see this is where I was looking before, and you can see that it doesn't look like I'm looking into the camera. A uh, whole video of you talking to, uh, you know, this way would look like you're not, um, you know, looking at the camera, so to speak, or looking in someone's eyes. So I'm going to look over here, make sure you know where the camera is on your device. And one thing that I have found is when you press record, the first image um, that you the first image um, that it records is the image it will use as a thumbnail. So if you're staring over at the record button, that's going to be the image that you're looking at the whole time um, as, as you know, these, these thumbnails are stored on, in Wii Video and then also as you, as you post in places. So I'm going to look uh, at the camera and maybe even smile. So when I press record, and here we go. So now it's recording. I'm talking, I'm looking at the camera, and I'm going to press stop. And that's my video. And again, you can see at least that some sort of attempt at a smile. Uh, good thing down in the left-hand corner is that retake button that you can always do things over. I'm going to use this video over on the right. Um, and I could have played it to, to see what it looked like before I made that decision. Uh, a big difference that I've seen so far, the app and the other one, is if you look down the bottom, you see the word app test. It's a six-second uh, clip of, of a title. So if I, if I press play, you know, you're going to see that word app test for six seconds before you get to my video. Um, so uh, you can decide if you, want, if you want to use that. If you don't, you can do what I'm about to do. And I'm just going to put my finger, touch the app test, and hold it down. And then I have this, uh, uh, this option of dropping it. Uh, the, in the top right-hand corner, you see that paper airplane-looking triangle, which is the send icon. I'm going to press that. And now I have the option of saving it to this, this iPad, which would be saved to photos, um, or share through Wii Video. And share through Wii Video is what we did before, where we're not um, taking the storage of our own devices, uh, but we're using the storage in Wii Video. So I'm going to press share through Wii Video, and the three dots uh, here that you see down there is... Uh, where I could you know, link it up to something else if I'm connected on this iPad to YouTube, which I guess I'm not. Um, and then you see private under that. The video will be privately shared on all linked accounts, including WeVideo. So um, 
that is default. If you look over next to that, the green, the toggle switch is on green. So the default is to make it private. And private means when you submit it, the teacher won't be able to, to view it. Again, private, um, making it public doesn't mean anybody can watch it, but it, it means that anybody you send the link to can watch it, and which is what you want. So you want to make this gray over here instead of green, and then you can share. And uh, this, this is the resolution. This, this will uh, determine how big the file is and how clear it is. I'm going to choose the bigger one, 720, and there it is. A couple uh, unflattering pictures of me down there when I didn't know where to look. Um, you see in the top right-hand corner of the app test video um, that it is taking some time um, to edit and, and um, reduce uh, the file. That, so that's, that's what's happening right now is it's, it's creating a smaller file that I'll be able to use and converting it. Once that's done, we're going to grab the link from it and copy it, and then we'll be able to go to the Schoology app and put it in your assignment. Um, Again, if, uh, you can come back to it at any time and get it, um, but if you are working on an assignment, you might as well grab that link right away and put it up. So, um, again, please look at the other video and take um, some time in looking on the, all the tutorials uh, online that show um, where, uh, where you can go with this program if you're interested. You know, for, for my music assignments, you know, I'm not going to be looking for feature films. But it, if you're interested, it's a pretty cool program. So there's three dots now. Now that this is done, there's three dots in the bottom right-hand corner of my video, the app test video that I'm going to touch. And I touch that, and now I can share or share link. Um, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to share a link, and now I'm going to press the word copy. So I could have... I could have taken that and pressed the um, you know, text message and shared it, but now I've got it copied, and now I would go to Schoology, and I would paste it, and we'd be done.